Okay, so what we're going to do on, on this particular problem is look at how to do rational exponents on your calculator, on your Inspire calculator. It's really not a hard process at all, but you just want to be working from your calculator. And uh, <clears throat> when you get in there, um, you're just going to start typing. And, and it's really simple. 9 and then the caret key and then 1 divided by 5. So that's going to be 9 to the 1 fifth power. There you go. There's your answer, which is the same thing as 3 to the 2 fifths. Now, you're probably not going to see 3 to the 2 fifths as one of your possible answers. So um, if your calculator defaults to fraction, if you need a number, go ahead and hit the menu key, go up and choose number, and then go ahead and convert to decimal. And then when you do that, boom, you got your answer. Okay. The other thing that you can do is uh, on the Inspire is you can do an nth root which the one-fifth is the fifth root, and if you'll notice the above the caret key is this little template guy, and then you can just plug in the numbers that you need. Well, we're looking at the fifth root, and then the tab key of nine, and again, hit enter, and then boom, it gives you your fraction answer, so it depends on how you have your calculator set up, and if you don't want the fraction, again, just convert it to decimal. It's not a hard thing to do. Don't let it be hard, and notice that you get the same number for both problems because they are the same thing. Okay? Well, what about 12 to the 3 eighths? You have to use your caret on that guy, but just, hey, 12 divided by 12 to the 3 divided by 8 power. That's it. And then, boom, there it is. And again, you're not going to see too many answers with 3 to the 3 eighths and 2 to the 3 fourths. So if your calculator is set up to default to a uh, fraction, you can go ahead and convert it to a decimal with a relatively few keystrokes. And then the same thing on 32 to the negative 3 fifths power. So it's going to be 32 and then the negative 3 divided by 5. So here's this guy right here. And he just turns out to be 1 8th. But again, if you love decimals on this kind of stuff, just go in here and choose to convert to decimal and hit enter and bang, there's your answer. So using the Inspire is really easy for this particular item. Uh, and it's you know gives it to you in a couple different ways for you to choose what best suits the need that you have.